So you want to get dressed for your day. I get it. Me too. That's why this is called Dress for Your Day with Kay Harms. But our days, let's face it, most of our days, we're just at home, right? Doing everyday normal things. We mostly wear casual things. We have a casual lifestyle. So today I'm sharing six great outfits that are perfect for every day during spring and summer. These are casual, comfortable outfits, but I styled them for you. Welcome to today's video. This is going to be a fun one because guess what? No sponsor. It's just me. <laughs> I appreciate so much you supporting and at least looking into the sponsors who sponsor these videos, ladies, because this is our bread and butter. This is how we pay our bills, how we pay our mortgage. This is our livelihood. And so we do need to take sponsors fairly often in order to afford to bring you the content that we do on a weekly and sometimes twice weekly basis. So I am so grateful that for those sponsors and I only take sponsors that I really, really love. I get offers, multiple offers every day and I delete, delete, delete. <laughs> I very rarely take the sponsors that reach out to me. So when I do, you can know that they are ones I truly love and I truly enjoy working with and I truly enjoy their products. I wear them. I love them. They're hanging in my closet. They're, they're the things I really love. That said, there is no sponsor today. Today, I want to share with you just six everyday outfits from my closet that I think you might have some of these things in your closet too. These are basically style uniforms. They are just you know, formulas, style formulas, things that you can wear on just like a normal day, a normal average day when you're mostly going to be at home. Maybe you're going to need to get out and run to the grocery store or run an errand. Maybe somebody's going to call and ask you to meet them for coffee or to get out and, I don't know, go play with the grandkids at the playground or something. You know, it's just kind of those casual outfits. I actually get asked more often than anything else about what to wear on just an average day. So that's what we're going to do today. I have six great outfits. Some of them are extremely casual. Others are a little less casual, but still really appropriate for home. These are all things that I do wear, would wear, will wear at home this spring and summer. Let's start with the most casual because I actually hear so often from viewers who say, hey, I take care of my grandkids during the day. I can't wear anything fancy and like we're going to the playground, I have to get down on the floor with them. So what should I wear? So for this first outfit, very casual, it is just some joggers from Talbot's. You could wear your joggers from wherever and a pretty t-shirt though. I think this t-shirt is supposed to be about little strawberries, but it's black and white or maybe black and ivory. It's a cute little t-shirt that I got from Anthropology, and I put it over my Talbot's joggers. And I actually did a couple of things though. Remember, stylish women style their clothes. <laughs> so you make some choices, right? So one of the things I did here was I actually pushed up the legs of my joggers a little bit so that I'm bearing a little bit more ankle. It is spring and summer after all. And it just looks a little active, a little fresh, a little bit more youthful that way. I do see younger women wearing them that way. So I thought, hey, why not? But if you don't like that, don't do that. Don't make that choice <laughs> if that's not your preference. And also this time, instead of wearing them with sneakers, which you absolutely can do, and I do that quite often, I actually wore uh, my Naote sandals here. So these are a pair of my, I think they're Wetus. Uh, by Naote and you know Naote these are the sandals that I wore all over London last August when I went I mean I, I think I walked in London probably the full you know 15,000 steps or 20,000 steps a day that we did in these at least several days and they served me so well so these are great little sandals for getting out and about with the grandkids or you know maybe getting out and about in your yard or you know you're doing something with your neighbor or whatever this is just a really good little outfit i think what differentiates it is that cute t-shirt so if you're going to be wearing joggers and t-shirt type thing look for some cute ones and this one's a cropped length you could give it a little front tuck or you could just leave it out which i think is probably my preference here 
So I think this is a fun little outfit, just kind of every day, spring and summer. Now, I guess the next most casual outfits would be the jeans outfits that I've put together. And I just have two of them today, surprisingly. So the first one is with a linen shirt. So I'm wearing a tank top, a pink tank top, and some cropped length uh, jeans here. These are from Talbot's. And I really love these little jeans, really great little straight leg, cropped length jean, just relaxed fit. And then I've topped the tank top with a pink linen shirt by Eileen Fisher. So it's kind of the same color. You know how much I love that little combination of wearing the same color outer piece and layering piece. I just think it's so smart looking. Now this is a pink tank top that was just in my closet from last year. So it's not a perfect match, but it's okay. Just getting close enough is good enough. And I love the way this works together. And here I wore some of those little ballet flats, those little sheer ballet flats with the little kind of, I don't know what those are. It's not rhinestones. I don't know. <laughs> Just little, little bedazzling all over them. I showed them in my previous video about spring and summer shoes. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link it up here and, and down below. Be sure and check out that video for all sorts of shoes. In fact, I'm wearing several of them today. But these little ballet flats are truly so comfortable. They really would be a good choice for around the house. And so that's why I wear, wore them here. I just think this is a really nice look for, you know, around the house, maybe you're doing some baking that day or some cooking, you know, just maybe some sewing. You're not cleaning anything, obviously, in this. I wouldn't clean things. I would fold clothes. I would do, you know, desk work and things like this in this outfit. I love this for every day. And this is kind of really how I dress a lot of spring and summer days. My next jeans outfit is with the pretty little shirt I'm wearing today. I love this shirt. <laughs> this is a Frank and Eileen shirt, so it's not inexpensive, but it is made from fabric from Liberty of London, which I love. I actually bought my little granddaughter the cutest little dress from Liberty when I was in London last August, and I thought, you know what? I need some fabric. <laughs> I need something from Liberty of London too. And so when I saw this, it's just such a cheerful print. And I've worn it with just some straight leg jeans, but these are carpenter jeans. I can't remember if I've shown them here or not before, but they are from Gap. And so they're not expensive. And they had the little carpenter, you know, loop for your ha hammer and little pocket there and everything. Do you remember wearing carpenter jeans or painter pants when you were in middle school and high school? I, I loved it. And so I'm really happy that this little trend is back and these were not expensive jeans. So I bought some and I think this looks really cool to pull this outfit together. Even though I'm staying home, I tucked in my shirt and I put in a cognac belt and then I'm wearing some little cognac color crisscross sandals that I recently got from Everlane. They are so comfortable. Love these little sandals. They are flat. I can't wear flats very long, so I probably won't be wearing them too long, but I do love this look. It's just so comfortable and so easy. You also could leave that shirt untucked, and I probably will do that some days because it just kind of lends itself to that too. It's not just so long, and I really like that about it. Love this look for a spring and summer. The next look is with some white little cropped pants, and these are from Talbot's. And they are just casual little pants. And I guess, you know, we were wearing what we call those cropped pants that are kind of just straight and kind of slim fitting. And I guess you could still wear those. In fact, I've heard that pedal pushers and like, you know, capris are back in. I'm not really sure about that <laughs> for us, but cropped pants I love. Like an ankle length cropped pant I love. And especially this silhouette because what it does is it gets out away from the body a little bit, so it makes your ankles look smaller. So when you can have more fabric, you know, more room down there around your ankles, around the bottom of part of your calf, uh, more space between your leg and the pant, that's actually gonna make your ankle look a little bit more, you know, dainty and small, and I need all the help I can get there. And so I love this length of pant. It comes in other colors too, and it's just really fun. And it is the softest fabric. It's just crazy how soft it is. And I just topped it with a pretty little t-shirt. So once again, a nice little t-shirt. I just think you need several of those in your closet, right? So I am all for having some basic white t-shirts and then like some of those in the colors that you like, like a solid pink or a solid red or whatever. 
but get yourself, if you're really gonna be at home, if this is kind of the lifestyle that you lead, then I think it's smart to invest in some pretty little t-shirts. This one is also for, from Anthropology. It's kind of a tie-dye. I'm not really sure it's actually tie-dye or if it's just some kind of print, but it's that tie-dye effect, just beautiful little blues, and I just kept it really simple here. I'm wearing some more Naote sandals, and they are some little slides that I just recently got. I don't remember the name of them, but I'm linking to everything below, ladies. I'm gonna give you a link. Just I'm numbering the outfits, as you can see. So you just look under that outfit number and you'll find everything you need there. These little Naote sandals are so comfortable. It'd be great walking sandals. Once again, they just don't have a back to them and they do run narrow though. So if you have a wide foot, you're gonna to wanna to just stay away from these but I have an average fit and they work for me, actually maybe even a little wide and they work okay. You probably work best with a narrow foot or just an average fit. Love these sandals, they're white and silver and gold. So that's just really fun. My next outfit, continuing with the white theme, are my white jeans. I'm actually wearing those today too. Just white straight leg relaxed fit jeans with a white tank top and then I've topped it with a linen shirt again. Now this is a blue linen shirt and I chose this specifically because this look also works really nicely with a chambray shirt. I just, I think mine's in the laundry or something, but a chambray shirt here would look really great. So if you have a chambray shirt, denim shirt, that would work perfectly, or even just a cotton shirt, a gauze shirt would also work here. But I do specifically love the blue. Now you can do different colors. You could do pink and red and all that, and I have those and I'll do that. But there's just something about that blue and white and then that cognac belt there in the middle and those cognac sandals. I love all of that. I just, cognac is so in. And so if you were to wear this around the house during the day, and then let's say you're meeting a friend for a frozen yogurt in the afternoon or something, this would look so fresh. You could wear this to Bible study in the morning, uh, wear it to volunteer at the school or something in your community during the morning. Just really a fresh looking outfit, but very comfortable for at home, very casual. Now on all of these long sleeve shirts, don't forget to just roll your sleeves up a little bit. Remember those styling choices that we're gonna make. You can pop a collar, you can roll your sleeves, you can cuff them up, you can tuck, you can not tuck. Those are just choices that you get to make depending on your personal style preferences, your body shape, your proportions, and all those sorts of things. But I'm trying to show you outfits that are simple, that are casual, but that are styled. And then my last outfit is linen pants. Now, um, I'll probably be kind of, actually I've already worn these. So I was supposed to say I'm saving them for summer, but I'm already wearing them. I'm just seeing linen everywhere right now, even earlier than normal. And so I went ahead and pulled out my linen. I bought these this year. These are the kind of a bear, uh, tapered or barrel pant, I guess even, from Eileen Fisher. They're in their white. I already had them in the natural and the black, so I thought, why not get the white this year? And I love them. Now, I've topped them here with a sweater. I'm trying to give you some little options that are maybe like things you wouldn't have thought of. And normally, I would wear this with a tank top and with those linen shirts over it or you know something like that, maybe even just a t-shirt with you know, kind of a little front tuck. But I actually love linen pants like this, these really relaxed, you know, elasticized waistband linen pants with a little fresh summer sweater or spring sweater. So this is a cotton sweater by a brand called Poetry. And I don't even have an affiliate link to them, so I don't make any money <laughs> off of, if you buy something from Poetry, I don't, I don't get any commission. But I love this brand so much, I wanted to share them with you. I actually bought a dress from them too that I have not pulled out yet, but this little sweater, it just lays so beautifully. It's such a pretty silhouette, a lovely color. It feels good on. I think it comes in other colors too. So I'll link you to this sweater, um, but I don't get anything for that. <laughs> That's okay though, because I wanted to share this brand with you. And I just think it is really smart to wear some, you know, uh, linen pants and a little summer sweater, whether it has sleeves or it's sleeveless or it's short sleeved or something like that. I just think it's such a cool look. And once again, uh, for my shoes, I chose some little sandals. Now these are some Eileen Fisher sandals that are actually linen <laughs> and they're in that natural color. And I just think they're so pretty. I tell you what though, I tried on several different pairs of shoes this outfit. I tried on my white loafers, they looked great here. 
I tried on some little uh, metallic uh, sandals. They look great here. It's just so many options, so many different things you can wear with your linen pants. And I just think this outfit is so fresh. Now, obviously, once again, it's not something you clean house in or you do any gardening in, but if you're having just kind of an easy day at home, maybe you're having somebody over, uh, you're just you know doing simple things around the house. I think it's so nice to look pretty even when we are at home and doing nothing special. So those are my six just everyday spring and summer outfit formulas that I think you can style and you can feel good in and you can look good in too. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Don't forget that you can shop each of these outfits. They are numbered below in the description box. Thank you so much for being here, ladies. I want you to know I really do appreciate you. You make doing this such a joy, and I love hearing from you. In fact, let me know which are one or two or three of these outfit formulas are the kind that you are more prone to wear during the spring and summer on at-home days. I would love to hear from you. Have a great rest of your day. Bye now.